how to do accounting research using RIA checkpoints. Let's start at the library's homepage, library.csun.edu. We're going to choose databases A to Z on the left-hand side of the page, and then we're going to choose R, and then we'll choose RIA checkpoint from our results list. And here's our homepage. So on the left-hand side, you can see that there are different areas you can choose. So under practice area, you actually can drop that box and you can choose a subject in there. And then we also can choose major categories like primary source materials. Within that, you can choose a subcategory. And then you also can look at the table of contents. You can check major news. You can also look at the tools. For example, there's a calculator if you need it. Pay attention to some of the other links on the left-hand side. You also can look at the citations. You can limit by date range. If there's a particular piece of legislation that you want to look for, you can do that also. So let's go ahead and do a sample search. For my example, I'm going to choose primary source materials. And then I'm also going to choose legislation. And let's type in the search box. I'm going to choose contingency. And I'm also going to search bad debt. And what's nice, it'll actually prompt you for different subjects, so you're welcome to choose one if it works for you. For my example, it's going to be contingency and bad debt expense. And then we're going to search. And this is our results page. So let's look at one of our results. This is what it looks like. For this example, this is actually a court case. And we're going to open it. And let's scroll down and let's kind of look and see what we have here. So there's a head note. There are also references. These are live links back to the actual court case that they're mentioning. So this will be really good for your research. So there's the court case. And let's close that and go back to our search. And that's really all there is to it. It's pretty simple. If you have any questions, let me know. You have my email. Good luck on your research.